Pat Love from Love Healing Hearts. I heard something a while back about a person who was in the middle of Christmas shopping and they saw somebody get real ugly with one of the employees of the store. And when the employee got really flustered and just seemed like they couldn't figure out what the heck they were doing or how to do it, when one person showed them favor, mercy, and compassion, they broke down in tears only to expose the fact that they were dealing with a suicide in their family. That had happened that day. But they went to work because they were desperate to keep the money coming in because now they were responsible for holding on to the apartment. And their income was all the family had to depend on. So they had to go to work in the middle of this of this uh, devastating situation of mourning a family member who had just committed suicide. And one of the customers had been very mean and impatient, said very cruel words to the person. Everybody be careful how you treat people during the holidays. The holidays are the peak seasons for people who commit suicide. And there are people who are left behind dealing with that and some that you're talking to or talking at who are considering suicide themselves. And you have no idea how bleak, how, how painful their lives are. You have no idea the strain that some people are living under. But you're so busy trying to buy presents and you're in the holiday rush and you're all excited about jingle bells and, and mistletoe and chestnuts roasting on an open fire. But you don't realize that somebody is wondering if they're going to shoot their brains out when they go home that night because they're tired of being alone. They're tired of feeling like nobody cares. They're tired of feeling invisible to a very, very busy, self-centered world. So be careful about how you talk to people. You may be the very mouth that pushes them over the edge with your pettiness. Please be careful. If this is supposed to be a, a season of goodwill, love, peace, and kindness, to one's fellow man. Try practicing that. It feels a whole lot better than being mean and intolerant. Okay? Well, God bless you. Have a wonderful Christmas holiday. And remember, spread the cheer. Don't spread fear. God bless you.